shot him, Ma. I shot him dead. Right then and there. I couldn't believe him, Ma. I just couldn't. It all happened so quickly. It all came to me so easily. I don't know how, but one moment I was sitting in the recliner, and the next moment, I was up on my feet, deftly pressing my fingers against the cold, hard metal, turning my body as I methodically loaded the shotgun. First one bullet, and then the other one, and then, boom! Just like that. In one little motion, I cocked it back and pulled the trigger. Didn't even give it a second thought, Ma. He was on the ground in front of me. I knew immediately that he was dead. No sense in wasting a second shell, right? So I unloaded it. I unloaded it, Ma. And what's worse is I put the unused ammunition back in its box. Why would I do something like that? Who kills another human being and then thinks, well, maybe I should put the unused cartridge back, huh, Ma? What's your explanation for that? How is this another instance of a good little kid caught in a bad situation, huh, Ma? <laughs> there's something wrong with me. And if there's something wrong with me, then there's something wrong with you. You brought me into this world. You raised me into this world. You were supposed to love me, Ma. But you, you never could, could you? You could never bring yourself to love a cripple. You could never bring yourself to love a child with a club foot. So much for every child is one little God's angels, eh? So much for that. So long devotion. So long love. It's so long in this ma. So long to the whole thing, the whole kid caboodle. I've never known the tender embrace of a mother's arms. <laughs> and explanations. I'm leaving, Ma. I just killed a man. Oh, Mama. <laughs> Mama, life had just begun. And now I'm going and throwing it all away. I gotta leave you all behind and face the truth. Funny, isn't it? Out of all your children, the one with the club foot is now the one that wants to run the fastest. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you worry too much about me, Ma. And I reckon I'll be okay. It's just there are a few things that I have to get off my chest before I skip town. And now that I've done so, I figure there's nothing left for me to do but to disappear forever. You want me to get any pulse for me, Ma? <laughs> Fact, you'll never see me again. <laughs> and when the police ask me where I've gone, I want you to tell them everything that you know. Now they're going to interrogate you. So I can't give you any information about where I'm going, except that it's going to be as far away from this place as I can get. <laughs> oh, mama. <laughs>
I'm leaving, Ma. <laughs> and I'm not coming back. Tell everyone. Tell them I'm real sorry. And don't want ever bother any of them. 